Newly public images reveal that North Korea has a second long-range missile base. One analyst says the base is a clear indication that the country is continuing to develop its ballistic missile program. Joseph Bermudez, Jr. of Jane's Information Group first located the site through satellite images. Another defense analyst says the site could enable North Korea to test nuclear missiles that could reach parts of the United States. It basically looks like the North Koreans are playing it both ways. On the one hand, in the six-party talks, they're talking about getting rid of their nuclear weapons. On the other hand, at this facility, they're clearly looking at developing the capability to deliver those nuclear weapons to the United States. Bermudez of Jane says the launch pad has been up and running since 2005, but hasn't been used. He located the site in the spring. A U.S. official says U.S. intelligence has been aware of the site for several years. Independent analysts say the base is larger and more capable than an older, well-known missile launch pad. They say the new facility is a major step forward for the North's missile program because it would allow multiple test flights in a short amount of time. John Pike of GlobalSecurity.org says North Korea hasn't been shy about putting its missile test facilities where the world can see them. This big facility suggests that over the next couple of years we're going to see a lot more tests, or at least the possibility of a lot more tests. Pike says it's not finished. A large vehicle assembly building still needs to be constructed. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.